Why do you take space dust? <laughs> to escape the monotonous routine of everyday life. Fair enough. The pain I feel for past <laughs> unrequited love. The harsh reality of human emotion and life. Wow. That's quite profound. Maybe I've misjudged you. <laughs> Thank you, talking peach. You're not so bad either. For a delicious fruit. Make sure to tell Banana he oh, still God. owes me 20 bucks. <laughs> oh, this game's great. Are there any side effects? Uh, blurred vision. You also turn into a metaphorical elephant. And sudden combustion. That's a pretty big one. Hasn't happened so far, obviously. Frankly, I'm not sure how I'm alive most of the time. Oof. What is uh, space dust? It's uh, space exploration in uh, powder form. Do you ever get to see any aliens? Yeah, but they are total dicks that don't pay taxes. Except for Florgan. He's alright. He pays his taxes, huh? Florgon pays his taxes. Uh, where can I find space dust? You Good guy. You can it yourself. It's a meticulous process of gathering rock samples from the moon. Be wary of the man on the moon, though. For reasons I don't want to get into right <laughs> now. And then I forget the rest. Alternatively, you can get it from your local family drug dealer for the lowest prices. Guaranteed. Oh, perfect. Mainly because he murders all the competition. Oh, yes. A true businessman. That's what we need. That's what we need. If it's uh, that simple, why don't you go yourself? Let's just say I had too much space dust. And let's just say I thought I was a rocket ship. And I tried to launch myself off the top of his mansion. <laughs> And, of course, rockets don't need claws. Anyway, now I'm not allowed to go there anymore. Is that why his face is all fucked up? <laughs> is there a specific amount you need? Infinite, please. I okay. don't think that's possible. If you look into your heart, Paradigm, you can do anything. Fox. Except maybe win a wire loop skill tester. And find happiness in life. Fox, mate. Fox. Inevitably regretting your decisions upon your deathbed. Can you show me where the drug dealer is at least? Yeah, alright. Do you have a map on you? Will this postcard do? I think so. Go to this place here. The little house on the mountain in the middle. <laughs> Bring me that powdery heaven. I've already got the suppository prepared. Uh, uh, uh. Then you can go on a spiritual journey with me to uncover the dark secrets of Krush. New original conspiracies? Yeah, want to hear about it? Uh, yeah. Fuck, I can't see you, dude. Long live the lizard people. Listen here, P. Diddy Diggum. Paradigming guy. <laughs> Ever wonder why there's only like five or six of us living here? Vague memories of childhood? Unexplained scars? Large hemorrhoids that are impossible to get rid of? Obvious listening devices? Now. I won't know for sure till my next drug-induced coma, but I'm pretty sure that... Pretty sure what? Uh... We're in an alien zoo? Fingers crossed they have a mating program. Valid. However, my theory was that we were teenage mutant cutie boys. What is cutie? Why does it keep saying that? Radioactive ooze, thus giving us amnesia. 
and trendy period relevant catchphrases. Now they are keeping an eye on us so we don't fight crime. Yours works too. Let's uh change the subject. Kawabungu. <laughs> I might need to leave now. The stench is too I great. I might need to leave now. The stench is too great. See you later. <coughs> Ugh. He just shits himself. All right, let's go to the drug dealer house. Not a drug dealer. I mean, dude, what totally, dude. June? Uns, 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 uns. The music only plays when you hover over him. <laughs> okay, dude. Bops for days, mate. Not a drug dealer, an ideal example of the pinnacle of concealment. You can see me down there, kind of. <laughs> Great. A windy road for artistic effect. No consideration for my fitness at all. I wish my diet did not consist entirely of coffee and cereal. Same. Check out that drink coffee, dude. Fucking hell, I gotta walk all the way Why? up here. <laughs> Why isn't fast travel implemented here? Would you like to make me walk or should we fast travel? Fuck that, let's fast travel, mate. Come oh, on. Come on, stairs? <laughs> no escalator? This isn't Rocky. I do not have the calves for this. What happened to the bird? Did it just get sniped? <laughs> I hate stairs. This is very hidden. It's a rare CCTV bush. It receives nutrients from invasions of privacy. <laughs> ah yes, the future bodyguards. Cheap, recyclable, and after you are finished, you can make some sweet blanket forts with it. No girls allowed. Beware of the bodyguard. Oh. What's this? Yes, yes. I too love butts. Same. Same. Wow, this is a limited edition Pushinska army knife. It's the only standard issue army knife to replace the knife part with a serrated spoon. Nothing like it will strike fear into the heart of your enemy whenever they hear stories of death by serrated spoon. If I take that, are they gonna kill me for theft? Oh, I'm not sure if it's responsible to use a serrated spoon here. Maybe it will be handy somewhere else. I've always wanted to crush army serrated spoon. Okay. Nice. I totally forgot these have a press to talk button. I am sharp spoon. I admire their spherical nature greatly. Nothing like two big grassy balls. It's a tobogganizer. Sort of like a personal digital diary. Compulsory to all citizens of Krush. No scam K is the guys is the name of the 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 fucking I can't even England mate the the, the the subject title is no scam K occupation real ghost and the date is oh one oh nine twenty twenty six hey that's not that far dude it's only like three years from now hey you there. Yes, you. This is for you, my dear friend, Paragé. B-R. What's that? He's just trying to, like, bold on the letters or whatever. I'm stuck. Oh, line break, dude. Line break. 
I'm stuck inside this dupe organizer. Please help me get my soul out of here. Otherwise, I'll be stuck in here for all eternity. Just follow this link. Oh, this link looks legit. Law.go go forward slash forward slash dot com and put in your credit card details and I'll be free. Really? That's all I've got to do? Please, friend, you are my only hope. After, I will give you my inheritance valued at 330 million BCD straight into your check account. Yo, I have to do this. We just need to go to this link. Make sure you guys go to this link. Alright. I wonder if this works. Hello, Intercom. I want to speak to your master. I guess I have to press the button. I thought this was the future. Wait, we didn't even check in that door. Oh, uh, probably can't get in. Uh... That's the way to do it, mate. Don't make it too obvious. I would like a burger uh, with a side of life-changing front eye-opening drugs. Damn. Now how am I supposed to write my deep and hard-hitting prog metal album? It's gonna be like, you go through all these and the only one that works is this. <laughs> the most simplest one, I bet you. Have you considered a new life insurance plan? I recommend insuring yourself against dragons and goblin invasion. In this economy, you can never be too protected. True. Hello. I have some cookies here to sell. I'm raising money to bring about the second apocalypse. And there are only two crush marks. I'm telling you, it's this one right here, man. I would like to purchase some space dust. Go away. Space dust was never sold here. I mean, what space dust? I mean, get off my premises, you filthy pig. My guard will kick you out if you try anything. Your guard is clearly just a cardboard cutout with a speech bubble drawn on it. Bollocks! You won't be saying that after he gives you a super insane paper cut. <laughs> it's gonna hurt real bad. And when you finally think it's healed, it opens up again. Shit, super annoying. <laughs> so I mean, I guess I was right, but <laughs> you won't let us in right now. Uh, maybe they'll tell them you're a fucking policeman. I hated the police academy movies. No one hates the police academy movies. Except for maybe after number seven. Hmm. Maybe you are right. I'm a part of a fat gangster hip hop group. Prove it. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a rap guy, and I rap, and I rap, rap and rap, rapping guy, and and I. Uh, uh, fumbling, bro. Uh, fumbling. That was terrible. I don't believe you. Fuck. Look at me. Do you think I could even run after a criminal? Fat policemen normally do the paperwork. Oh, I just meant I was unfit. Wait, do you think I'm fit? I am not a cop. I can do that too. I am not the droid you are looking for. Droid actually lives down in Crossevia. Isn't this fun? Yes. If I were a policeman, could I do this? What? Sorry, I was supposed to do something that proved I was not a policeman. Well, 
If the goal was to look like a dickhead, you did it. Aced it, even. All right already. Jesus. This is going nowhere. I tell you what. If you bring me the severed head of a policeman, I'll let you buy from me. Whoa. Isn't that pretty brutal? <laughs> Not if you're a gangster thug like me. Now get the hell out of here. Easy, mate. I can do that. Jesus Christ. I can't murder anyone. Yes, we can. He is? I can't even tell if a fly passive aggressively. Maybe I can order a canned head of Ibeski. Ugh, Ibeski. I don't have time for that. I guess I could go look around. I'm finally starting to remember where everything is. Flushing all that milk out of my system is letting me think clearly again. I could probably check my shop, uh, the junkyard, and or butt observatory. <laughs> Uh Fingers crossed there was some local decapitations today. Okay. Check the uh Check the shop I guess. Oh jeez. Someone broke my door and window. Igorski, why do I even have you in here? You've been drinking again, haven't you? God damn it, you're so hideously cute. That's a cute dog, that. You. <laughs> Looks like whoever broke in dick left butt. the road <laughs> Courteous, courteous dick. He was a good boy. I can't really use Say that every time I see All it. he does is drink vodka and eat kubasa. More of a local drunk than a dog, really. Say that every time I see a dog in a video game. He was a good boy. Yeah, you are. It's a controller for some console. Hopefully an expensive one. Well, I would much prefer to be playing video games right now. I don't have a console to play it with. I guess it could be handy. That's why you gotta pick everything up, dude. I don't need this. Pick up the dog. I could if I wanted to lose some limbs. I'm already severely deformed. I like to at least have full mobility. All right, so we're just looking for a decapitated head. Interesting. It was a dark time trying to pay the bills. I try not to think about it. Oh, that's sick. Then there will be none left for my fans to buy. <laughs> I am. Uh, I am not very good at lying. Fat beats to work out. The generator is full enough for now. I can get at least four death metal albums out of it. It's the transcript from the advertisement radio station. I was hoping to get some dope audio samples from it, but mostly it was more procrastination. Tax Evasion the game. Hey there Billy, do you like video games? Yeah. Do you like the gross amounts of virtual violence? Yeah, yeah. Do you like doing taxes? What? I'm 11 years old, mister. Well then you'll love our new game from Mega Bronx, the company that Bought, brought you such hits as Boosting Fogs, Zeldario, Zany, Man X Zone, introducing Tax Evasion, the game. Play as multi dimensional company with fun gameplay such as threaten or bribe government officials. Oh, we need to, we need to decapitate one or right all. I don't know if I can say that on, um. Well, this will be getting posted on YouTube. Maybe I'll, uh... It's just in the game. This is part of the game script, for fuck's sake. Choose which offshore countries to put your profits. Recruit a dream team of lawyers. Find and silence whistleblowers. Whoa, cool. <laughs> okay. Grandma insurance. Oh no, grandma is gone. What do we tell Billy? 
Don't tell Billy a thing. Grand insurance is to help. We'll send a clone replacement of Grandma within one business day. <coughs> She'll be baking cookies straight out the stasis box in no time. Just remember to clean the stasis liquid or uncontrollable bloodlust may occur. We'll guarantee a cookie cooking, sweater knitting slave for years to come. Dude, I'm gonna get banned. <laughs> Available at clonegrandma.com. Thanks, Grandma Insurance. What would we have done without you? Gene Pierce's new album. Gene Pierce's. Gene Pierce's. What a weird name. This decade. This decade's modern musical genius is about to drop his new, most anticipated album of 2026. Our love is drifting apart. Here is a small sample. Mmm, amazing. How does one duck contain so much talent? Is this worth reading? Fighting icons. This Sunday at Motorplex, fighting icons. We bring back the clones of icons throughout history and answer the age old question Who would win in a fistfight between Abraham Lincoln and Gandhi? Hitler and Joey the Kangaroo? Beethoven and Biggie Smalls? This Sunday, Do you find it close to impossible to get up to exercise? Sweat no more. Fantastic fitness will remove your whole body so you never have to worry about nutrition and weight loss ever again. Apply now for a 30 day money back guarantee. Hello, I'm Liliana, your local barber yaga witch. Offering my services on the weekend half price. Neighbours on your nerves. I'll curse them half price. Can't find a husband or wife? Buy morally questionable but romantic love potion half price. Hate your husband? Buy erectile dysfunction potion half price. Call 0589... Okay, I'm not reading it. For a price today. Cheers. Keep that in mind. Prepare yourself for groundbreaking gameplay. Oh wait, I don't actually have an animation cycle for sitting down. Ah, uh, never mind. So it's gaming show. <laughs> oh, it's the squares, dude. Yeah, I got a pretty good deal. This was half price because it belonged to a meth cook. Not because it was a meth lab or anything. He was just terrible at negotiation. What a nice asshole. He left me a note. Hello, proprietor of computers for sale. I am looking for an individual named Paradigm. He is hideous. You might know him. While knocking on your door, I accidentally slipped and broke through your door. I then accidentally searched everything inside accidentally. My mobile is broken, so I will come back to contact you. Sorry about the door. I tried to fix it. I attached this clip uh, of a cool song to say sorry. Aqua. Duper Genetics Henchman. Oh, that's really nice of him. It's very thoughtful that he left out, actually. I'm already using it for insurance fraud. Uh, I... <laughs> I mean... Sorry. Uh, I have no idea where my caravan disappeared to. Uh, this is a new one. Yeah, I got a pretty good deal. This was half price because it belonged to a meth cook. 
Not because it was a meth lab or anything. He was just terrible at negotiation. Can't even go inside. Okay. While I eat nothing but coffee and cereal, I occasionally treat myself to Pop Gymno frozen pops. Water flavor. Deliciously plain. I don't really need any water flavored Pop Gymno frozen pops right now. Why not? People used to live there. Then rats infested the place. Then mutated rats took over. And then eventually the rent got too high and they had to leave too. Maybe there's a, uh, a head inside of them, mate. Don't seem like there is really much here. Does a dog need feeding? Igorski's bald. He consumes nothing but vodka these days. Occasionally he's on poop if he is feeling fancy. I need to put something in here first. I need some vodka, bro. Where do we get vodka, mate? Did we have like a container full of vodka? Why could we just do that? I have no time for drawing pixelated nudes. <gasps> oh, some here. Jupo. Sewer dweller. Man, the cartoons really made it seem a lot more glamorous living in the sewers. I've been down here now for three months looking for a rat to teach me martial arts but all of them are pacifists and talk about politics what the hell man what kind of politics do rats have to worry about hmm. i don't know that's kind of crazy <laughs> all right guess guess we're not supposed to be here mate could be at the junkyard instead. Ow. Oh wow. It's an incredibly rare it's in your just hit me in the head. airplane bird out in the wild. This is truly a magical moment to behold. It looks like it uh, has some sort of message from me. Sorry, Pepe Airplane Bird, I had to open you up. To Paradarm. Your life is in medium rare danger. Okay. Someone is after you. We are organizing your rescue. Hold tight. Paxter Rebels. P.S. Can you give me some critiques on my vague warning message skills at Fight Club Best Movie at AOL.com? True, it is a good movie. I'm an unpaid intern at the Pagster Rebels trying to go full time rebel. Much appreciated. As much as I would like to use it for dressing up as a sexy policeman, I could use it for something else. Right, I'm just. Sorry, Pepe. Where you doggo? Oh, so organizing a rescue, okay. Sometimes I like read shit and I don't like take it in. Like, does anyone else have that issue? Or like, I just don't, I don't know. I get fucking distracted, mate. It is a crane which is hanging conveniently over the cone trademark. In the plastic Going for my own trash would only make me more aware of my terrible lifestyle. There might be a head inside, though. Ooh. I don't feel like playing lucky disease deep today. Let's take it, man. I'm sure it might be handy to contract a life-threatening disease, but to be honest, I think it would just weigh me down. Dude, it's like... It's like... Fucking... 
It's not even a pound, mate. Oh, so, hey, can we just take his head? It appears to be a mannequin with a wig on. Get away from me, you mutant freak! Step away from my wife! Ah, yes. When I thought they couldn't get any weirder, there we are. That's his wife. Hello, strange cone guy who I have so far successfully avoided talking to. Hello, Don Cone based humanoid. <laughs> Isn't that cone crushing your face? The cone and I live as a symbiotic being, the sum of our parts stronger than any individual. Just like two cop partners starring in an 80s action slash comedy slash drama slash epic TV show. Also, yes, it is horribly painful. What is your weakness? Yeah, that's a great idea. I'll go around telling people my weaknesses all the time. I'll tell you my weakness. When cones fly... <laughs> He's a funny guy, isn't he, Rolla Manisha? Not as funny or handsome as you, though, the cone trademarked. I love you, darling. <laughs> Me too, he <laughs> he So, you're saying, if I want to take your mannequin, um wife's head yes i knew I it would have to take advantage of your only weakness flying cones have you considered having some other weakness maybe checkers i'm pretty good at checkers and it could be a very exciting mini game what never mind i knew it that's why it says detachable on the head what's in the bum bag justice Seriously though, it's just a fashion accessory. He's on deep and real zips. What's your origin story? My mother was a cone. I don't think that's physically possible, <laughs> but uh, go on. It was a forbidden relationship. Needless to say, she was a terrible mother because of her lack of limbs. But I love her all the same. I also have a crippling, crippling fear of letter drivers. Yeah, makes yeah. sense. Thanks. I really need your mannequin. Can I please have it? What mannequin? That one over there. All I see is my wife. You're so handsome, the cone trademarked. Damn it. This is going to be harder than I expected. I'm gonna have to steal our fucking head, dude. Wait, what is he, his weakness? I, if we can, if he tells what his weakness, I know he already weakness? said it, but yeah. let's just That's reread it. That's a great it. idea. I'll go around telling people my weaknesses <laughs> all tell. the time. I'll tell you my weakness when cones fly. <laughs> He's a funny guy, isn't he, Rolla Manisha? Not as funny or handsome as you, though. Okay, I can't wait when he's solo. Me too, he <laughs> he. So, you're saying, if I want to take your mannequin, um, I need to make cones head, fly. I would have to take advantage of your only weakness, flying cones. Have you considered <laughs> having some other weakness? <laughs> Maybe checkers. I'm pretty good at checkers, and it could be a... What? Never mind. Okay. Laters. Goodbye, oh, let's go, mate. Cone friend. Cones fly, then I guess. Should be pretty easy. There's a fan right there, mate. That's what we need. Cutting edge special effects. Impressive. In all honesty, if I owned the cape, I would probably do the same thing every once in a while. It would be great to have at least one fan, even if it is an inanimate one. However, I'll leave it be for now. Hmm. <gasps> oh, we can just put a fucking police hat oh, on the yes. mannequin. I'm gonna have the sexiest police costume. Yes, mate. What are the chances of that, eh? You would think this would be the solution to get rid of the cone, especially with the crane hanging conveniently over him, but it is most definitely not. Hey, that's my washing machine. Rest in peace, little guy. You slayed a many a coffee stain. Shh, 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 shh. 
you're in a better place now. If it was a cyborg arm? Yes. I would pick it up. Hello, you creepy mannequin. Ugh. It looks like it has already been used by the con. Oh. Nasty. This appears to be the con's abode. He's dirty. Dirty abode. There is an old crush proverb. N never enter the home of a man who wears no pants. Okay. If only I could. The amount of sick dress I'd do would be insane. I have enough junk in my shop as it is. I find a lot of computer parts for my shop here, but mostly I find self-loathing. Right, what do we have here? Wait. Oh, I can give the vodka to the dog. I forgot, dude. Can I give her the heart? <laughs> that would be a waste of a sexy police costume. All right, let's go give the, the, the dog some vodka, mate. If only everything could not be so good at everything. Point joystick oh, up to do be a cool guy. There we go. Igorski, lunchtime. He must not be hungry. Oh wait, this vodka is only 40%. I need to make it stronger somehow. <laughs> Okay, let's try this other place. John is calling me. Hey, mate. It's me, John 3000. I managed to form the connect to your headset again. So on, blocked me out last time. Weird. Heh. <laughs> yeah. Weird. Anyway, been tuning this new bird. She wants me, hey. <laughs> Check out this sound boy. She's like me. Super bonds are hot. Oh. oh yeah makes me sweaty just listening to it can uh, oh can you so please hot. leave me alone yeah right just to be clear if you don't get this floppy soon the station is gonna melt down real soon everyone will blame you for millions of deaths for centuries to come no biggie <laughs> Oh, that's not good. What? You know, she might be too late. I had so many biddies to cyber with. <laughs> I guess this is goodbye, Paradigm. Oh, jeez. Oh. Oh. His face is all messed up. Oh, God. What just happened? Oh, just a little bit of hopper visual simulation I implanted into your brain via sound waves. Just wanted to emphasize this destroying the world thing, since I would die as well. Not too keen on dying. I feel an email would have been more appropriate. Huh. <laughs> yeah, well, bye. Haha. <laughs> Ugh. I feel so dirty. A dupe organizer. She's a saleswoman. Doroka S. Sometimes I go up here just to get away from everything, you know? Up here, I can breathe. Everything makes sense. I can finally imagine myself as my true self. Doroka, the giant. Destroyer of worlds. What? 
You really slighted me, God, when you gave me this human body. You could have made me a mythological demigod, but no. I'm Daroka, computer saleswoman. Cheers. <laughs> Do, do, I don't understand, do, do like Americans understand what cheers means by the way? Like Audrey told me they don't. But like we just say cheers as like thank you. So when, when you say cheers it's just like thanks. Obviously she's being like sarcastic in this case but yeah. It's so hard hitting and Truthful. It's made me rethink all my motivations. I can't wait to forget this in a few minutes. Ha. Neo Soviet unit symbol. After their first fall, Union. they decided to do some remarketing. They were on all the social media. <laughs> Neo Lenin even had a Let's Play channel. Until they fell again. Let's like, play, dude. And conform. <laughs> Do that, guys. Do that, do that. My Let's Play channel, dude. Like, subscribe, and conform. That's what you should all be doing to show your support. Welcome to Krush Bat Observatory. It was commissioned during the Neo Lukewarm War as a representation of Neo Soviet Union strength. However, in secret, it was used as a cover for a missile silo, primarily to thwart any spy's credibility. Upon telling their governments that the large genital sculptures were nuclear weapon facilities, they were left out of the service, allowing the Neo-Soviet Union to have the best missile offensive at the time. Um, I'm joking by the way, I'm not, I'm not an actual just let's play channel, but I figured like I may as well on my YouTube, um, I may as well post like let's plays as well, right? Cause there's like times on my YouTube, cause everything's like, um, well, what it used to be, everything was like hilarious, like funny content and shit, and that all takes time to like get, like that takes a lot of time to get. So that, like, in between, I may as well be posting other types of gaming stuff too, you know. Um, so that's what, that's Cute. what we're doing, dude. It is a little model launch pad of the bloody Krushkinov launch tragedy. Neat. Okay. There is no time to play poorly funded space program. Sir, we need the rocket. Sorry, John, we've got to see what's next on. Help, my dog cheated on my wife. Turns out repairing magnification glasses is expensive. Although, I must <laughs> say I'm impressed by this artist's rendition. I, Paradigm, will kill myself. They cancelled me canceled on social media. My favorite TV show oh. before its time. Okay. It's probably what would I'd say if I was going to do it. Ha 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 ha. Ravin of Lethal Death. I can't think of a good use for the Ravine of Death. Oh, the Ravine. Why is there just a random, like, hole in here? Uh, wait, I keep forgetting I got stuff in my inventory that I can use too. I don't need to create any political change right now. Um, don't know, I'm not really seeing. You make my rocket launch. I like there was a guy out there somewhere who thought oversized band aids was a good business plan. It's working, mate. Butt crack. There is a crack which happens to be on a butt. Please, don't make me say it. Hmm. I, uh, don't have any witty comments. 
I specialize only in human mutant poop jokes. Never take another person's debogernizer. It basically just locks your account immediately. I heard it from a friend. A basically. Dude, they locked my account too. But I have no idea why. Mountain Castle. Alex Castle. He locked himself in there to prove some points. When in reality, he's just a dick and no one wants to save him. Oh. So he's doing us all a favor then, eh? Lake Papushka. No Loch Ness monster, but uh, we do have a flesh eating virus. Uh... If only everything could be controlled via game but controller. Dang it! be so good at everything. Point joystick up to be a cool guy. Oh, maybe there's nothing here yet. Gotta go bark, I think. Is it something to do with the generator to like. or the ethanol to create an explosion? Paint thinner mixed with ethanol. Essential for your everyday needs. Yes! The power station seems to be working fine, so uh, I don't need it. Um. Before doing this, I do not recommend drinking paint thinner. Unless, of course, you have a stomach of horrifying Oh dog. my god, dude. We have been warmed. We did it, finally. <laughs> Igorski, lunch time. It's gonna knock him out. Oh, Jesus. I hope I didn't give him too much. <laughs> Igorski, are you okay? It's fine, mate. It's fine. <laughs> Good he's, dog. He's drowning, I think. <laughs> okay, so we got the call. Now back to the junkyard, I think. Oh, yeah, I don't really know what Everyone to do with this. That line, it's not rocket science. I've always wondered how it must feel for actual rocket scientists, you know? How many have broken down emotionally from hearing that joke so many times at dinner parties? Oh, now we got the flying cone, bruh. We got the flying cone. Yeah, it is a terrible place to launch it. Uh, okay, I know where we gotta go. Let's go here. Boom, dude. Is there something inherently wrong launching something that the con has psychologically personified into ultimate destruction? Then ripping the head off his wife to trick a drug dealer into Ma. thinking I murdered a police officer? No, Most I'm people would say yes. They no, probably fine. would be right. No, totally fine, mate. Just go ahead. Hmm. It doesn't seem to be working. Oh. It has a brain of its own. Oh, yeah. 